The World Meteorological Organization, WMO, is an intergovernmental organization with a membership of 191 member states and territories. It originated from the International Meteorological Organization, IMO, which was founded in 1873. Established by the ratification of the WMO Convention on March 23, 1950, WMO became the specialized agency of the United Nations for Meteorology, Weather and Climate, Operational Hydrology and Related Geophysical Sciences a year later. Its current Secretary General is Petteri Talas and the President of the World Meteorological Congress, its supreme body, is David Grimes. The organization is headquartered in Geneva, Switzerland. The World Meteorological Organization, WMO, is a specialized agency of the United Nations. It is the UN system's authoritative voice on the state and behavior of the Earth's atmosphere, its interaction with the oceans, the climate it produces and the resulting distribution of water resources. WMO has a membership of 191 member states and territories as of February 2014. The Convention of the World Meteorological Organization was signed October 11, 1947 and established upon ratification on March 23, 1950. WMO became the specialized agency of the United Nations in 1951 for meteorology, weather and climate, operational hydrology and related geophysical sciences. It originated from the International Meteorological Organization, IMO, which was founded in 1873. The WMO Hierarchy The World Meteorological Congress, the supreme body of the organization, determines policy. Each member state and territory is represented by a permanent representative with WMO when Congress meets every four years. Congress elects the president and vice presidents of the organization and members of the executive council, and appoints the secretary general. The Executive Council, EC, implements Congress decisions. It coordinates programs, manages the budget, considers and acts on resolutions and recommendations from the regional associations and technical commissions, and studies and makes recommendations on matters affecting international meteorology and related activities. The Executive Council normally hold a session at least once a year. Six regional associations, RA, are responsible for the coordination of meteorological, hydrological, and related activities within their respective regions. They meet once every four years, and elect a president and vice president. The president of each regional association is an ex officio member of the executive council. Eight technical commissions are responsible for studying meteorological and hydrological operational systems, applications, and research. They establish methodology and procedures and make recommendations to Executive Council and the World Meteorological Congress. The Secretariat is headed by the Secretary General, who is appointed by the World Meteorological Congress for a four-year term with a maximum tenure of eight years. The Secretary General appoints all staff, including the Deputy Secretary General and the Assistant Secretary General. The Secretariat currently has around 300 staff. Weather, climate, and the water cycle shape almost every aspect of our lives. They can be benevolent and bring abundance and well-being, but they can also be dangerous and cause great damage. Weather dash, climate and water-related hazards account for nearly 90% of natural disasters. These powerful natural forces do not recognize national borders, thus global and regional cooperation is essential. Global data are needed to understand the behavior of the Earth's atmosphere and its interaction with the land and oceans, whether it be to predict next week's weather or next year's climate, forecasters must have timely, quality-assured, standardized information coming from all corners of the world. Even the accuracy of a two-day weather forecast relies on observations from far beyond national borders. The World Meteorological Organization provides the framework for this essential international cooperation among the national meteorological and hydrological services of its 191 member states and territories.